All right, man, torture talk. Six o'clock show, six o'clock show, man. Look, so academics is at it again. Acting academics. You know what I'm saying? Academics is at it again. He's out here throwing up the glaze signs, the glazies, you know what I'm saying? For your boy Drizzy Drake. He's attacking Kendrick online and DJ Head and uh yeah, we're going to get to that, man. Before I get to that, you know, I got to get my spill. This is Torture Talk. If you like the content, please consider subscribing. If you're new here, let me work for your subscription today. All the beautiful, sexy ladies. Put one in the chat, baby. All the fellas, y'all know where to find the ones that just don't harass them. I don't sell no merch, but I do have content that's absolutely free. But if you want to leave a donation, links is on the screen. Cash App, PayPal is in the description. All that good stuff. Thank y'all for all y'all donations. I truly appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? Working, working, working towards a million subscribers. They called me the Hidden Gem. I went from 1,300 subscribers to over 11,000. You know what I'm saying? I should be about 12,000 by the end of this uh, week. And um, yeah, man, it's a good feeling. It's a good feeling. You know what I'm saying? Let me know where you're from, too. So we're going to get right to it, man. We're going to get right to this clip. Let's get it, man. Let's get it. All right, man. Let's go, man. Six o'clock. Let's go. <laughs> when is it a good time to kick your enemy when he's down? Maybe you say as soon as it's announced that he loses his platform, because if he can't speak to the public, then maybe your words will be amplified instead. But if it's probably a temporary ban from one platform out of many, we'll learn the outcomes of that as DJ Academics was banned from Twitch. And then while he was down, was made fun of by none other than DJ Academics current arch nemesis, DJ Head. All right, so why was he banned from Twitch? Somebody said earlier that he's banned from Twitch because he was doing something with Aiden Ross, and Aiden Ross is banned. But why is Aiden Ross banned? I don't know. Maybe y'all can let me know in the comments. I don't have a Twitch channel. I do play games, but I don't have a Twitch channel. I know a lot of people don't use Twitch for gaming. They use Twitch for podcasting, too. You know what I'm saying? So... Sometimes it is like that, but this is interesting. This is very interesting. Um, and uh, let's see where it goes. DJ Academics was banned from Twitch, and then okay, so it says Academics has been banned from Twitch after streaming with yeah, see, he's streaming with Aiden Ross. So he was streaming with Aiden Ross on Twitch, and he got banned. And I didn't know Twitch does that. I didn't know they does that. I didn't know Twitch do that where if you if you are streaming with someone who is banned, you get banned too. Damn. <laughs> I don't know, man. You should have uh damn act. I thought you knew everything, man. Where's Drake at? Maybe he can help you out. Maybe he can get you out of this. <laughs> while he was down was made fun of by none other than DJ Academics current arch nemesis DJ Head and Academics will respond as they go back and forth on Twitter which ends up leaving Academics learning a valuable lesson what's up y'all it's your man Talkless World reporting for the Chick Smooth channel we gotta talk about this while on his live stream that's multi broadcasted on all the streaming platforms, DJ Academics partnered with Aiden Ross for his live stream, who is banned on Twitch. So his appearance on DJ Academics live stream calls for DJ Academics to be banned on Twitch. As Complex will report, Academics have. Damn. You know, you, listen, man. You know, we have changed. The world has been changing to the point where. Social media wasn't a big deal. Now it's a big deal. And now we're, we're reporting on people getting banned off of websites. Before, you didn't give up. You didn't care. Nobody cared if you, if you didn't uh, do it, you know, didn't go on Facebook or whatever. Now it's like it's so integrated in our lives that people can literally lose hundreds and thousands of dollars because they got banned off of a website or for platforms and they changed, they made these things lucrative but at the same time they making they making billions off of it and we're making crumbs and it's like they can ban you for some shit you know what i'm saying that they just disagree with and it's like 
And, I, and there's some people who get banned and they don't even do anything. They just get banned. They'd be like, why? why? They'll send you like, it's just crazy, man. It's crazy. Let's go. Been banned on Twitch after streaming with Aiden Ross, who is currently banned on the platform. Also, Aiden Ross is the owner of a competitor called Kick. So that's a big reason why Twitch doesn't want him. Wait, wait. Aiden Ross? owns kick oh he's a part owner of kick that's new to me he owns kick i think drake has something to do with that too right oh man this is getting interesting besides his reckless actions on their platform but dj head will see this tweet and reply stay on stream now this is just a continuance of the rap war <laughs> oh my god <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that is classic. Oh my God. That's classic, bro. Shout out to DJ Head. That was classic, bro. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> if you know, you know, nigga. Oh my God. Damn. That was classic. <laughs> Stay on street. <laughs> Woo! Ah, uh, that was great. Uh, laughter is something that just cures the soul, man. Oh man. 2024, Woo. as DJ Head is close with Kendrick Lamar. So these are the media arms of these camps going back and forth. But DJ Academics would not take even those three words lightly, responding, I will. I'll be back on stream tonight on YouTube at 8 p.m. Eastern for another seven hours with over 17,000 watching concurrently the whole time. Anyhow, how's your podcast views looking though? Probably could use a Kendrick Lamar stimmy, huh? Any podcast that can get a Kendrick Lamar interview right now will certainly benefit from it. But but see, that's like, I guess the clap back, he kind of got to defend himself. But I'll be honest with y'all, the stay on stream is just, that is, that's the chef's kiss right there. Damn, that was good. You can't, you can't get around that academics. He got you on that one. He got you. What do you think about that? Because we know DJ Academics is about to go on his live stream and talk about the numbers. Should Kendrick Lamar appear on his comrades' platforms, whether it's their music, movies, or their podcasts? Let me know in the comment section. But DJ Academics will also continue by reposting one of his other accounts that posted Academics was YouTube's ninth biggest watched streamer in North America in the third quarter of 2024, which is a huge. But see, the thing is, academics, you got to learn how to read the room. Like, everybody knows that, you, that you're pretty big, bro. You're pretty big and you got a big face, bro. Look like uh, Jerry from Tom and Jerry, right? You know what I'm saying? Everybody knows this, bro. It's not a, it's not a secret. So you putting this up just makes you look even more corny. It's like everybody knows this. It's like somebody saying they sold a million records and then placing the numbers of them selling a million records. Everybody know you sold a million records. It's like it's corny. Huge deal. And he would comment saying niggas was pitch silent when this came out yesterday, but wanted to jump on D today. Either way, I still whip y'all media niggas combined. So not only is this a continuation of the rap war of 2024, this may be a competition of different types of media in regards to live streaming versus podcasting. Let me know what you think about that. But eventually DJ Academics would come to terms tweeting why someone said I risked my Twitch account 
for Gucci third leg, LOL. Damn. Puts it all in perspective now, LOL. Pause. Yeah, sometimes all content isn't good content. And for those wondering, the Twitch suspension is actually not permanent. As academics would tweet, oh, by the way, it was a 72 hour suspension on Twitch. Shout outs to my Twitch partner manager. Not gonna lie, they did warn me over like four times in the past about streaming with Aiden. They def don't F with that nigga. We on YouTube till then. Love Twitch always. So DJ Head might have taken his shot too soon. We'll see it all play out. Let me know what you think about this situation. I don't think that's the case. I don't think DJ Head took a shot at, at too soon. I think he just said that as a joke because he act would come on in and say it was this song. There was a song coming out from Kendrick. I mean, from Drake and he and Drake told him to stay on stream. So he says, stay on stream. It's a, it's just a joke. And I think that him, him, him saying that was classic though, because academics is known for saying that. And, and it plays into, that's why I said like whatever academics was saying doesn't really make a difference. It doesn't matter. But uh, I'm going to end it there, and I'm, I'm going to talk about it. Yeah, so it's like, it's like with him saying stay on stream, what academics don't understand is, like, he's basically saying, like, like we, know you, we know that you are the number guy. We know that you have the numbers. We know that you are big. He made it as a joke, like, stay on stream because you got banned. But he's basically saying, like, okay, you, we know you got 17 to 27 a uh, hundred people, a thousand people to watch you. We know that. So it's a joke saying stay on stream because we know you just got banned. But at the same time, I don't think that he took his, I think it just was a, a joke. You know what I'm saying? Like it was a joke because it's like, oh, he's saying he got banned. So he's like, I'll oh, stay on stream. Like it's a joke. Everybody knows it's a joke, but people take it serious. They take things to the next level. And it, to me, it's kind of corny. I will say this. <sighs> Academics, man. Sometimes I don't know how to even I know I know what he stand for and I know where he at. But sometimes you don't really know where academics is at. Because I feel like sometimes he has a double like he has two personalities. Like he's like a different person sometimes. You know what I'm saying? He might have a twin who who fills in for him. And not to say that any one of them to personalities are good personalities it's just he approaches things differently when he talks to them like and and a lot of times i think he's looking for clips for content so he can so he can uh monetize off of like the thing with him in um top five when he was asking like i heard y'all the top shutters you know what i'm saying stuff like that and then he's like yeah yeah i'm drake shooter blah 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 and it's like that's why I said sometimes you got to be real careful who you talk to and, and what you say, because they use this stuff in the court of law, man. And if you out here talking about you did something to somebody and you is ready to do something to somebody, you think you don't think that they're going to use this against you, especially if something happened to that person? Like, that's one thing I don't understand about a lot of y'all streamers. Y'all allow y'all get on here and. I ain't gonna say y'all allow these people because you you not you, you can't control what actually comes out of people's mouth. I mean, you can you can, you can you know not put it out. You know what I'm saying? That's so that's one way, one form of uh, controlling. But if you doing it live, it's something different, and you can say yo like you can stop them like yo no I can't I can't lie now. When he's saying he's asking him openly like what you going to hey they saying that Kendrick gonna go to a uh, new whole king and he gonna eat some fried rice. What you saying? And here he go. <laughs> <laughs> that'd be the last place he'll be like just like and then and then they try to cover it up by saying it's this is just content it's like nah dog that's not how this works you can't say something or threaten people and then say it's just content it don't work like that you can't you can't do that bro you know what i'm saying if somebody punch you in the face and say it was just for content you can't say nothing like that was just for content bro you know what I'm saying? I just don't, I don't get it. But I think that that was hilarious that DJ Head actually did that and um, really put academics on his toes. I think that academics, you got to understand, he he does a lot. He does a lot, but you, you could, you could, you could be, 
you could be a polluter, man. You could do a lot and still pollute. Like, you could be a polluter. You could do a lot and put stuff in the air that's just not good. A lot of toxic things. And I just think that that's what he does. Academics is a polluter. He's a polluter. He puts out stuff in the air and people, you know, get sick from it. So either way, man, thank y'all for watching, man. I'll see y'all in the morning, man. Yeah, man, I'm out of here. I'm about to go get me some good dinner, man. See y'all, peace, bye. <laughs>